Here I come, mystery monster. Sounds like a weird monster goat. Well, it doesn't sound like that, but that's what I'm guessing it is. Sounds like bloody Chewbacca or something, I don't know. so happy to see you. Wait, let me get this straight. This quest was just to track down a stupid llama? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we did have a pig as a friend, so... It's not just a stupid llama. It's, uh, it's important, okay? It's apparently like, uh, treasure-sniffing llama, or, uh, it's important, okay? Please, just trust me. We just need to bring her back to her owner. It doesn't need to be like a thing. Why all this secrecy? Are you okay? I'll tell you about it later, okay? But I appreciate you worrying about me. Now, how about we get you out of here, huh? Make smoochy noises. Yes, let's make the smoochy noises. Come here, llama. Come on, come on. It's gonna like. Oh! oh. <laughs> That's what you get for wearing that dork armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll just have to craft a new set. Dang. Let's get this thing. Don't let it get away. I was just about to like fart on me or something. I didn't realize I was gonna do that. Just grab the. <laughs> Damn. Put it in the cross face and everything. Don't you be looking angry at me? Oh god, I just no, spat on my face. Come on, let's get after that armor wrecking thing. Uh, hang on, it's super dark down there. We should make a torch. Alright. Recipe stick and coal, I guess that is. Success. Here, nice. llama, llama, llama. Where'd you go? After you, Mayor Jesse. Told you I'm not the mayor. I'm the leader and hero in residence. I know, I know. It's just that you do a lot of paperwork and like town running things. Caution. Oh, there he goes. Look. What the heck did you get up there? Look at him looking all knows, evil. Coming down now. Come here, you silly llama. What the? Yeah, what's that green thing up there? Find out. I don't think the llama's that big that he was blocking Jesse's view. What was that creepy whisper? Uh, I didn't hear anything. What the hell? Saying they're not and they're not showing it in the subtitles. Whoa, girl! What is it? Some sort of glove or gauntlet? Looks like it's made out of prismarine. A prismarine? But you only find that at the bottom of the ocean.
weird. Oh my lord. Whoa! Uh, how did... Where? What is this thing? I don't know. I, I don't know. It, it, it seems like it's not hurting you, and that's good. It looks kind of... Okay, actually, it looks really cool. Uh, which I know might not be what you want to hear right now. I didn't get the chance to bloody press the button. Well, uh, here. I'll help you take it off. I don't think it's coming off. Get it clickety click. Okay. Ow. Wow. Stop. That thing is really stuck. I just can't shake this feeling that... Maybe you were meant to find that gauntlet. Like, maybe it was your destiny or something. Huh. I hope it's not like a curse. That's usually what leaves things stuck to you, right? Yeah. Until you die. Uh, but I want to see my hand again. What's happening here? I hope. Uh oh, get off the pyramid quick! Oh! Help, 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 help. I don't want to fall in there. Come on, let's get you up out of there. Clickety clickety click. Save me, llama. Hey, now, what the heck is that thing? It's like a huge mouth in the ground? Some sort of. heck mouth? Sure, yeah, heck mouth. What the hell's that? I, I don't think I can see the bottom. Ugh, it gives me the willies. And. What's that sound coming from down there? Yep. Wow. That is bottomless. Well, we, we can't just leave something like this exposed. We, we should cover it up. Yeah. Agreed. Okay, give me that dirt. Give me that dirt. What is that? Not sure, but I'm getting a bad feeling that it's the actual way we're going to fix this. On second thought, let's talk about it anywhere but here. Not getting out the way we came, though. You can open it up, so. You can break through it. What am I looking for? What am I looking for here? Look, I think that goes to the surface. We're gonna bring the llama? We came all this way, we're not even gonna bring it back with us. Come this way for the llama, and we're gonna leave it. I thought that, that green thing was like a, a portal. Like a portal to some bad world. That's what I was getting. Oh. oh. It's just Jesse. Thought somebody was taking a violent poopsie. Oh, she did bring the llama. <laughs> oh, it's so close to Beacon Town. Here, uh, maybe you could leave a warning or something. Um, uh, warning, heck, mom. <laughs> These are all not very good. <laughs> Um, yeah. Straight to the point. I like it. Okay, then. <clears throat> what do we do about all this? Huh. <laughs> He's pissed. Well, it's all made of prismary, right? And you only find that in, like, monuments and stuff at the bottom of the ocean. And there's a treasure hunter in Beacon Town named Jack. Kind of a legend. He knows everything about Prismarine, exploring the ocean. That's our guy. Because we definitely can't have that happening again. That was... That was really bad. And you trust this guy? Yeah. I mean, I never met him before, but I've heard a lot of good things. 
and I'll take you to Jack's shop as soon as I'm back. But first, I really need to deal with this llama. Okay. Come on, you. Huh? Gotta get you home. What about my hand? This thing won't come off. I... Yeah, I, I know, I know. But this llama... Why is that llama so important to you? <sighs> you know my sword? Gold one, with all the enchantments? Miss Butter? Yeah, I... I kind of got tricked by this person named Stella. Said she just wanted to put it on display for a little while. And now she won't give it back until I do dumb quests like this for her. It's, uh, it's been not great. Hoping this is the end of it. I can't believe this person tricked you. That's terrible and so unfair. Oh, I couldn't agree with you more. So, yeah, her, her name's Stella, and she's kind of obsessed with treasure. She says this is her treasure-sniffing llama, her... She runs a place called Champion City. Wait, like, Champion City right over there? I had no idea that a leader was like that. Yeah, she's <sighs> ambitious. What a weird facial expression. she's willing to do expression. anything to get her way. Bullying, lying, cheating. Without my sword, I just really need to get it back. Just hope Stella actually gives it back this time. I'll help you get it back. You're one of my best friends, and it sounds like you really need my help. For the record, I don't need help, but thank you. Don't worry, we're gonna get this whole mess sorted out. Hope you're right. Then, freshly rearmed, we'll come back, sort out that heck mouth, and get this thing off my hand! Hmm. <laughs> Very nice looking place. Jovial music. Is that a statue of the llama? I think it is. Oh wow. This is it. Champion City. Every single nice. one of those apartments up there is exactly the same. Stella is strict about how things look here. She claims the top level are the diamond class apartments, but they're just one block wider. It's really champion city, then where are all the champions, huh? It's more like llama city. <laughs> uh, yeah, good one. <laughs> We're almost there. It's like she doesn't want to go see Stella. I kind of know how she feels. I just really need this to go well. And with Stella, well, it doesn't most times. Hey, that's why you've got me, remember? We're a team. We will take care of this no problem. Sure hope you're right. Anyway, Stella usually has her office hours in the center of the courtyard. So, what, are you just well, gonna let me go? She's ready for an appointment with Jesse and Petra. Oh, now the llama's coming with us. Come on, then, llama. Oh, well. Probably gonna be a half an hour looking at all those stuffs. This Stella person sure likes her llamas. You might say she likes them better than people. Huh. <laughs> Mine entrance. Got it. Wow, that is a classy mine shaft entrance. Didn't know they could look that nice. Ha, huh, yeah. Nothing's allowed in Champion City that doesn't look nice. Stella makes sure of it. Hmm. All right, then. What else we got here? Some of these guys look like football players or something. Bunch of furatos. Talk to the gardener. Yeah, okay. Hello, Mr. Gardener. Wow, even the flowers are organized. Yeah, and see the gardeners working on them? They all owe her stuff, too. Everyone in town owes Stella something. 
I think that's where she got most of the materials to build Champion City in the first place. Lots of little trades all add up after a while. Wait, the whole town? How? Yep. She's always finding little reasons that people's trades aren't enough. Making up with rules. Well, your sword is Talk. one trade Stella won't be getting out of. I'm gonna make sure of it. She sounds like a maniac. What the hell's going on? Nice day. Huh. Guess they're not allowed to talk. Look at distant cityscape. Can't believe Stella built this whole city. Yeah, she probably did it. She probably got someone yeah, else to do it. But it's all fake. Made by people she's tricked into doing it. I'm not even sure she even remembers how to build anymore. What a ferret. Confront Stella. Yeah, there's nothing else to do. Else popping up, so let's do it. Let's go in front of this fat up. Oh, fatata! Where art thou? Oh, is that her there? Ugh, there's Stella. Yes, that's right. Puppies for everyone. No shoving now. We're not beacon toddlers. <laughs> Huh. You probably put this together right now, but Stella's pretty fond of herself. I would play to her ego. Oh, well, that is a cute one. And he could be all yours. Provided you have the right payment, of course. Oh, she matches your outfit. Rodrigo, could you bring Luna home, please? I don't think she, the llama, likes being here. There's I don't a good blame girl. Him. Stella. Oh, look who it is, Jesse, leader of Beacon Town, and my sworn rival. I've never met her before, right? No. Our rivalry, Beacon Town versus Champion City. Never Surely heard of you it. think about it as much as I do. Oh boy. There is no rivalry. Sorry, but you are not my rival. Even my B-list villains are way scarier than you. I do not know what kind of mind games you are trying to bring into our rivalry, but I'll tell you right now, they are not going to work on me. I don't know what you're talking about, lady. <laughs> I love the glove, by the way. Absolutely, darling. You wouldn't be interested in trading, would you? Got some fine puppies here. All free range, of course. Just a puppy for this? That's a terrible trade. Rude. I just thought I'd offer. I heard what you need fuck? a new pet. Okay, hold it. Oh, Petra, you're here too. I almost thought Luna just came back on her own. What do I owe you? A puppy? No, no a sword. That wasn't a diamond, maybe? No, I... An emerald. <laughs> Don't push too hard now. That's... Ugh. Don't make me get tough here, Stella. You know what Petra wants. We're not leaving without that sword. Wait, is this about... Oh, Petra? Oh, sweetie, no. We're... I was very clear. I make trades for treasures. I think I'm all done here. You said you just wanted to display it. I thought I could still use it. Oh, no, honey, no. <laughs> you wanted to become my champion. You came to me, remember? In exchange, you got to live here instead of Beacon Town. Isn't that nice? Oh, no, was that supposed to be a secret? <laughs> oh dear, Petra, sweetie. Wait, what? You live here? I, uh... Well, what the hell? Well, I think it's about time I go back to my treasure hall, Jesse. By the way, way nicer than yours. Why do you live here? Did you, you turn fat? around? 
Of what am I saying? Of course Petra does. If you ever want a place in Champion City, just ask. <laughs> like I said, she's the worst. <laughs>